it is a good feeling that we don't have to worry about where we're going to put our head at night and it's it's amazing like getting us into housing and get all the sources that we need. Kimberly Lambie and her fiance have been here at Switchpoint for about a week. Their hope, their next stop will be a place of their own. And that's part of the goal here, where there are enforced rules that include bag checks, curfews, a strict no drug policy. At first, Michael McCoy was worried it was too structured. Not anymore. The structure's done a lot of good. He now sees the staff as helping the residents learn self-reliance. They're trying to help us build the life skills that we need to succeed after here. Carol Hollowell is the CEO of Switchpoint, the nonprofit that runs this place. She was in Tooele today when Governor Cox announced the good news. We did receive uh, the, the word that we have the funding to continue for another six months.